What's up folks, back at you with another serial review video and today is actually a serial war. It's a civil war. We have Golden Grams versus Golden Grams. Let's go. Bow down to the, bow down to the cave. If you like Golden Grams, drop a like on this video. Tell me the first time you ever ate Golden Grams, if you remember. If Golden Grams is one of your top cereals, comment that down below in the comment section. The reason why we have to have this civil war today is because normal Golden Grams, as we know it, have changed. General Mills have been doing this thing where they're going back in time with their retro flavors slash ingredient listings. So they're trying to capture something that they've had before. They're doing it with Cocoa Puffs. They're doing it with Tricks. They're doing it with Cookie Crisp. So we're gonna go through all these General Mills cereals one by one, and we're gonna find out if it's just a marketing ploy or if it's actually different slash better. Golden Grams got that retro recipe. Apparently, I can't remember the last time I had Golden Grams, to be perfectly honest, like a, a decade, I don't know. So we're gonna try these ones first. We're gonna see how they are. First and foremost. Oh, those aren't too shabby. Those aren't too shabby. Got them over here in milk. I know I've, I've seen and I've heard some people say, that Golden Grahams are their favorite all-time cereal, or Golden Grahams is like a top five or a top three cereal. I was like, man, that's a bold statement. Dry, they're pretty good. With milk, huh? Decently solid. I gotta eat this bowl and be just fine. I don't know if I'm ready to say that they're my top cereal or even a top ten. Potentially underrated though with my whole Overlooked series that I've been doing. I might even label this as that. This is definitely an Overlooked cereal. Overlooked by me. Okay, so that was actually decently good. And we're gonna try the old recipe now. Hold up. Well, the old one smells different. I can tell you that much. It smells way different. The old one crunches different. Way different. This is the new one. Wow. Oh yeah, incredibly different. It, it, it's not a marketing ploy. You can tell right off the from the get-go that there's a new recipe in, in the house, like flat out. And trying them dry, I definitely like the new but old recipe. <laughs> the new version, the new but old version, whatever. Let's try the old, old version with milk. I swear. I feel like these probably are more true to graham cracker with the texture and how they actually taste in milk. But the new, new, the new, old, new, new. It has a sweeter, longer lasting aftertaste and a more hearty crunch than the old version. So yes, General Mills has absolutely changed the recipe. And I am there to saying that the, they've changed it to something better. They've made a change for the better. This is good, this is good. Not good enough to be in my top 10 cereals of all time. Not at all, but this is good, this is good. So if you are a big time fan of Golden Grahams and you were a fan when they were this, then you gotta be a fan even more so when they're this because it has absolutely improved. So go get yourself some. I've seen it literally in every store. Go get it. Hope you love this video. If there's any other cereal comparisons that you would love to see me do, make sure you comment those down below. And if I like that idea, and if other people like that idea, then I guess we gotta do it. But I don't know unless you tell me. So comment that down below. Hope you have an amazing day. Join the Key Fricka Club. Just freaking do it. And then like and subscribe. Until the next one. Peace.